Hello friends. I want to show you something this today that is very special to me. In the background, you may see something that looks like a house. Well, it is a house. It is called a miniature doll house. I'll try to open the door so you can get an idea of what is in here. It looks a lot like someone's real house. There is a baby bed. There are lots of chairs. There's a family. On the bottom floor, you may see a piano, a dining room, a kitchen. Upstairs, you will see a porch. Even on the porch is a miniature Monopoly game. There are children sleeping. There is even a dog. A dog. There is even a bathroom. an ironing board. Lots of fun things in there. When our daughter was little, we had a friend to make it for her, and she and her grandmothers had a great time furnishing the dollhouse. We have kept it until the next generation will hopefully get to play with it and have a good time. It's one of my favorite toys from her childhood. Well, while this is a miniature house, so it's a lot like a small version of a big house. Today's scripture is a small version of the entire Bible. Let me explain. The word I want you to keep in mind for today is summary. A summary is like a small version of a big story. So if you think about one of the key verses in today's scripture, which is John 3.16, it is like a summary of the whole big Bible. And if you recall, the Bible has 66 books in it with Old Testament and New Testament books. But if we put all those together and had a summary, one sentence, many scholars believe that John 3.16 is a summary of the Bible. I bet many of you have heard it. Maybe you've memorized it. It is certainly one of the scriptures that I memorized as a child. For God so loved the world that he gave his only Son, that whosoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. This talks about God's love for you, for me, for everyone all over the world. God loves us without condition. God simply loves us. And God loved us so much that God created his son Jesus in his image to come and to live and to reign among us. And then God loved us so much, Jesus loved us so much, until Jesus gave his life and died on the cross for us so that you and I can live in eternity with Christ. This challenges all of us to love each other as God loves us, to love each, each other as Jesus' light shines through us to other people. So 
Remember the word summary. Remember our key verse today, John 3, 16, which is from the larger scripture in John today, which is John chapter 3, verses 14 to 21. But John 3, 16 is our summary of the Bible because it reminds us that God so loved you and me, God so loved the world, that God gave his son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross so that you and I can be forgiven of our sins and live in eternity with the Lord. And you and I are challenged to spread that same love and light of Christ to all those that we meet. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you that we have your Son, Christ, who has given all for us. We thank you that we have an opportunity to share your love and light with others. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. Anytime you want to come see the dollhouse, tell your mom or dad or grandmother or aunt to bring you to my house and I'll let you see it. God bless.